What's up, everybody? YouTube world, um, Instagram, Twitter, whatever. Um, welcome to the struggle zone, man. What I wanted to do, man, I'm gonna deal with this uh this situation with Nick Cannon and um, Viacom, right? Um, let me say this: the reason why we deal with these people, man, is because we are working as individuals a lot of times, and that's our that's our downfall. Those of us who have resources, who say hey, we need to work in unison. See, we don't really need Hollywood or none of these people. You know what I'm saying? If it was not for black people, Hollywood would have crashed and burned a long time ago. So with that being said, we have to ride with the brother Nick simply because, just on GP, because he's from the soil. You know what I'm saying? He's from here. He's a part of our lineage, you know. As far as I know, he don't have any immigrant background, parents, or anything like that. He's from the soil. But, at the same time, we do need to uh, watch him closely. You know what I'm saying? This is not emotion. This is just, just on feelings. Because a lot of times what happens is they would establish a certain... Um, energy around a certain individual like maybe they will like sometimes they'll push people out there and have them out there as if they're riding for their people so they can use them um down the line in the future to undermine us i'm not saying that's what they're doing with the brother nick cannon that's not what i'm saying i'm saying that we never side. We would. We cannot ever side with Viacom against against our own people. We ride with our people regardless of the fact. But I don't want us to be foolish and um, get it wrapped up into a whirlwind where we're well. We don't recognize if if somebody's going to be used against us in the future. You know what I mean? And I hope that's not the case. You feel me? And I think it's good that he stood his ground. He didn't come out and apologize. We don't. We don't need. <clears throat> we don't need cats out here apologizing. You know what I'm saying? If you say something, stand on your square. So shout out to the brother Nick Cannon. Uh, we got to ride with him just on GP alone. Uh, and Diddy came out. Um, telling Nick to come to. Uh, Come over to a revolt, which I think uh, is a good thing. Um, but I want our people, man, to stay focused. Uh, let's not get sidetracked. And we need to start building our own networks. You dig what I'm saying? Just think, imagine, man, for those of us who got money and resources. They need to be working behind the scenes to create networks. You know what I'm saying? And that way, we're not up under the thumb of some other people. You feel me? Because we technically, we don't need Hollywood. We have great writers. We have producers. We have directors. We have people who understand the business. We have people who, who understand acting, who don't get the opportunity. You know what I'm saying? That... Unless you're a token Negro. So we need to open up doors and make it possible for those type of people to to bring forth um, their craft. We need to understand that we, we're stronger when we work together. This is why the Europeans is, is able to do what they're doing. It's not because they're smarter or they're better at anything. It's that they have a code that they are going to work with their own people they're going to hire and employ their own people to put them in those positions and if they do allow negroes in there these negroes going to have to be screened they going to make sure that these negroes don't have any type of backbone that's not going to stand you dig what i'm saying and technically we can't be mad at them what i'm saying we have to do the same thing 
we have to create our own networks. Work as a unit. You know what I'm saying? It gets it get things done. It sh we shouldn't have just one studio. We should have multiple. We should have multiple different networks, people producing content. That's what we need. We need content makers who understand this shit. You feel me? So that's just what we need, man. So shout out to the brother Nick. Um, just, man, let's just shut them off. You know what I'm saying? Don't watch them. And just do our own thing. Since they don't want, since they want to act the way they want to act, let them let them have Viacom, let them have BET, VH1, MTV, all these different shit. Let them have that shit. Now's the time for us to cre create our own. You did create our own shit, so we don't have to go to these people for nothing. You dig what I'm saying? Put their asses out of business. Don't support their advertisers. You dig? And that's how we move. That's how we move, man. From here on out. Fuck Viacom. We don't need them. Or none of that shit. They can, they can have it. I don't know why I'm just feeling so sleepy and tired right now, man. But, yeah. That's what it is, man. To the struggle, struggle zone, peace out, man. And understand that what we have to do is build something. A network for our people. I'm gonna do my part. I'm not just gonna say what black people need to do. I'm gonna say what the efforts and the things that I'm trying to accomplish. That's what I want. You dig what I'm saying? So if 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 some of you out there who want the same thing, start writing, start creating material, start developing certain content that we want to see. You dig what I'm saying? I'm gonna do my part. You feel me? And I want those of you who's in the entertainment field to do your part too. And then we can blend the different talents and skill sets together and we can create our own network and our own content that we support, you know what I'm saying, financially and otherwise. So we don't have to worry about these people. Don't give these folks no type of power. Don't take our creativity to their networks. Let's create our own. And this is what I'm. This is something that I'm working on. Something that I want to do. It's taking me a minute, taking me longer because I'm doing it this way. But I don't want to give my content, and my material to Hollywood in any way, shape, form, or fashion. I want to own it, control it, develop it, 100%. And that's what we. That's what need to be done. So I'm going to do my part. So I want everybody else who's a who understands the concept of writing and producing quality content let's do that we don't need we don't need hollywood period point blank peace out man